somebody walking by in here next. <laughs> We're out here doing something new. I've never done anything, you know, quite like this before. But uh, you guys aren't going to guess what it is. I mean, I don't know. You might. You can see where we're at, what we were just talking about. We got something pretty sick coming up. Big Sugar Creek is where we're at right now, and uh, it's beautiful out here, all right? It's just a small creek that flows in through the woods of good old Missouri, and there's smallmouth in here, there's carp. I mean, there's all sorts of stuff out here. Just go for it. Just go for it. This guy behind me, I don't know if you can see him, right there. He ain't catching nothing, dude. He's at like the most populated, pressured spot right now, and he's out here casting, dude. No chance. Oh, yeah. Give her the gears. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, he's making it. I can't take him anywhere. He's always messing up my fishing spot. That guy is pissed. Surprisingly, the Chevy made it. Now we just gotta get all of our camping and fishing stuff out and set up and we're good to go. We got camping stuff, we've got hunting stuff, we've got fishing stuff. The plan for tonight is we're getting ready to go out, catch some goggle eye. Last time we were here, we caught a bunch of goggle eye and this time we're gonna keep them, we're gonna cook them, we're gonna eat them and that's our dinner, hopefully. So if we don't catch them, we don't have any dinner. After that, we're setting up our tents, gonna get some fires going. And it should be good. So anyways, I'm going to switch you guys over to the GoPro because we got to catch some dinner. So I'll see you when I'm <laughs> ripping lips on some goggle eyes. Catch you out there. Got something. Goggle eye. Eh, what do you think? Yeah, he'll keep. He'll keep? Yeah. Number three. Boom, son. Third keeper goggle eye. Going on the El Stringer. Let's see. Let's see, let's not drop them. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, dang it. Yeah. What do you think? No? They're not much smaller than that other one. No, the uh, the big smallmouth came up to it, and I thought he ate it. But then this guy, I don't know, somewhere along the line has got a little interception. Dude, of course. What? I cast it out there and it hit a tree and it like wraps around. I break off and then the lure falls in the water. What do we know? As you can see, we're fishing in a pretty cool spot. Dude, that water is dumb clear. You could, dude, on, the, on camera, the water looks sweet. It'd be really sweet. Dude, if there was trout in here, I wish this thing had a whole bunch of trout. That'd be awesome. But look at this. Look up back here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. As you guys might or might not have seen, I just broke off. So, I don't know what to tie on. That right there is that little minnow bait I'm throwing. I caught a couple. Uh, what were those? What were those? I caught a couple goggle eye on this little bait. And then I had like a small on, lost it. And then I had that big old tree right there. And I broke off on him, unfortunately. But I guess there's a big deep hole back over here. That's where he's at, so I'm going to go ahead, tie this on, and move over there. The scoop. Here it is. Uh, we still have, what, we have three keeper goggle eye that we're eating tonight. We only got three of them, all right? And now, as you see right back here, this old man, he's setting up our tent. I guess it's a gigantic tent, what, six or eight person? I don't even know. Doesn't even know. It's either like a six or an eight person tent. We got plenty of room, just the two of us. Nothing fancy going on, but uh, we just got to set up our tent, so... We're gonna go ahead and do that before it gets dark. And voila, we're kind of a big deal. Uh, dude, this looks like some naked and afraid right here. With this little thing? Yeah. Dude, you can see forever. Just, what take, you... just take your shirt, let's take our shirts off, act like we're yeah. all naked and afraid. Dude, the bug, oh, it's really gonna look like with all the bugs fluttering this light. For my choice of fire start, and we got this right here. Not your typical mom shampoo is what I call it. And then we got this little concoction I made. It's called toilet paper roll, dryer lint, and uh, paper towels. First step you wanna do is break your lid on your little shampoo bottle, and then just flip this over, sniff it a little bit. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's nice. I almost would eat that if I wasn't smart enough. Oh yeah, baby. Ow, that's hot. Something tells me we're gonna be going through a lot of firewood tonight. Just stick your finger in there and just kind of scoop them up and pull them out. Let me see those fish real quick. Before you cut me up with that knife. Oh, he's still kicking. Doesn't have no gills, no guts. Yeah, dude, like season it like a cultured woman. Like, not in a sexist or racist way, but you know what I mean. They're going to cook fast. You better start dusting them. Just You're going to eat the eyes? I don't think this is going to work. It better work because if this doesn't work, we're not going to have anything to eat. We're going to be blowing cheeks for the next two weeks. <laughs> All I know is there's my air mattress and there's the sleeping bag. <laughs> That's a good time. Oh, dude, here. That's what you need. Oh, yeah. Would you like some fish with that seasoning? <laughs> I'm just going to go in like a dog dude, and that. start. Right off the bone. There's a head. Get rid of that. Oh. <laughs> right on the tent. <laughs> I thought we were closer to the creek. No, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, not gonna lie. That one ate. This one not. Ah. All right. Dude, this is worse than. <laughs> That's all I'm doing. You're not eating anymore? No, dude. I got, I got everything. Holy cow, you picked that thing like an eagle. Yeah. Pretty good. You'd be better off snorting methamphetamine than breathing out here. Too deep, dude. <laughs> dude, you, can't, you guys don't even understand how many bugs are in front of the camera right now. I got scales in me, on me. Bugs the same, so I'm going to turn this light off. I got some ramen noodles. I'm going to cook up the ramen noodles on the, on the propane thing. You guys aren't stupid. You know what it looks like. Nobody wants to see that, so I'll catch you guys later. This is... Oh! This is ridiculous, dude. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I'm moving this thing over here. Video that Bigfoot over there. Water, tent, water, and then woods. Alright, it sounded like there was something walking through the water. We're not 100% sure. We checked for the glare of eyes. Didn't see any glary eyes, so, you know, we don't know what's going on. But listen, I don't know, you can't hear, but there are some bullfrogs out here. It's pretty good. A lot of bugs, but... I don't know. We're gonna get up in the morning, hopefully get onto some smallmouth. Should be fun. So, oh, too far. Oh, too much. Perfect. But we're gonna get up, we're gonna fish a little bit, pack everything up, and then we're leaving to go for, we're leaving to go for another pretty cool adventure. It's not with fishing poles, it's not with kayaks or anything. It's with yours truly, the good, the one, and the only, old Stephanie. I'll catch you guys in the morning. <sighs> Okay guys, so it is the morning, as you can see, it is currently 6.01, I don't know if you can see that or not, but uh, just, just listen here for a second. So those are bullfrogs, and they've been going steady all night. I kid you not, they've been, like, literally, they have been going all night. I slept like a rock that wakes up every 45 minutes, but other than that, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, focus. There we go. Alrighty, guys. Fishing pole. Beautiful morning. Again, just look at this. We're literally out here, nobody else. No signs of people. Pulled the truck up on the rock bed. We got the whole entire creek to ourselves. Last night we fished that direction. I think this morning we're gonna get up and try and go that way. I'm gonna go ahead and start smallmouth fishing. All right, baby, let's catch some fish. Got him, baby. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I saw him eat it too. What is that? Big old goggle eye, dude. We should have had this guy last night. There's the bait of choice, little Ned rig type deal. And then got a big old goggle eye. Let's get him back in there. Boom, son. There he goes. But I was fishing it. 
I was popping it off the bottom, popping off the bottom, and then I stopped. Didn't see anything, started reeling in. Saw him chase it, stopped it, he ate it, and then I just whoop, set the hook on him, and the rest was history. Oh my gosh. Big old smallmouth. Huge smallmouth. Dude, for this creek, that's a monster smallie. Oh, 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 I thought I had him. I thought I had him. Another, holy cow. Dude, I'm on fire. Oh, dude, I saw that monster smallmouth and I thought that was him. I was excited there for a second. Got the hook set of a lifetime on this kid. Big smallmouth. Oh, no, no, okay, get low, gotta get low. Bro, I just, I just pulled it out of the mouth of a big small mouth. Oh, oh, he doesn't know I'm here. All right, we broke off, caught a couple goggle eye. Sun's coming up, I think it's about time to go see what breakfast looks like. It's gonna be a lot better. I could huff that all day. <laughs> the best season? Oh, we gotta come up with like a slogan. Slap your mama if you want a minor felony charge. Just somebody standing over the <laughs> A couple of rednecks making love in the woods. <laughs> I'm on her scent. Look at that, guys. That is a. Mmm. Mmm. What we got? Show the fans what we got. Here. He probably just comes down here every morning and feasts off of people like us. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. I like. I like it. I like it. You just stick them in the ground. Dub. I bet you that worked for pigeon. I've got decoys out there. I just, yeah. I'm just wondering how they work. I think you just set them on the. You just like stake them into the ground. But they're not. They're not. They don't move or anything. I don't think. Uh huh. So we're on our next adventure right here, and um, we're going pigeon hunting. We found this spot. There are like, dude, stupid amounts of pigeons. But that's what we're getting ready to do. We're in Walmart. We had to get some batteries for our decoys. We had to get some shells to shoot, so it's all good. But I think this is going to wrap it up for this episode. I'm going to turn this into a two-part series about our camping fishing. And now we're going pigeon hunting. Thank you guys for watching. White Lightning Outdoors is out of here, folks.